mother for the murder of her two young children. The boys are found Saturday night with multiple stab wounds inside their apartment at a family shelter in the Bronx. CBS News' Neil Maldonado has the very latest on the investigation. 22-year-old Damone Fleming of the Bronx has now been charged with the murder of her children, identified overnight as 3-year-old Deshaun Fleming and 11-month-old Octavius Fleming Canada. Monday morning, residents in the Bronx neighborhood stopping by this growing memorial, sitting outside the Echo Place family shelter, leaving messages behind for the two boys. Yeah, I know the family. A lot of kids used to play outside. The father's a great dad. Like, I, the kids were always playing. A family friend holding back tears tells us the mother needed help. I'm quite sure of some things that I, uh, I'm not going to disclose, but um, she just needed help. You know, just after 7 Saturday night, police say they got a call about an emotionally disturbed woman acting erratically but nonviolent. Fleming was then taken by EMS to St. Barnabas for a psychiatric evaluation. I see a lady that she was acting crazy, she said, oh my God, what I did, what I did, what I did. So I asked her, yo, miss, what happened, you okay? And she looked at me. But she didn't say nothing to me. Shortly after, another 911 call came in about an assault inside the same third floor apartment. When police arrived, they found the two young boys unresponsive with multiple stab wounds. Both were taken to the hospital where they were pronounced dead. Police sources say the children's father, Columbus, Canada, had returned to the apartment shortly after the mother's arrest to find his sons with stab wounds in the bathtub. The medical examiner's office has yet to announce the children's exact cause of death. As you can see, a memorial remains here outside the shelter. Candles still burning, two teddy bears and balloons, all in memory of those two little boys. Now, no update on that psychiatric evaluation the mother was said to undergo. For now, she remains in police custody. For the Mount Hope section of the Bronx, Zinnia Maldonado, CBS.